Hey guys, what's going on? It's Anikis Fitch, and today I got a very exciting email that I'm excited to share with you guys. Hey guys, what's going on? So today I got an email from a service called Ancestry.com, who I'm sure you've heard of. Um, they're a service that do lots of heritage tracking and DNA tests. Um, and things like that and a couple of weeks ago i bought one of their dna tests and i spat in a little plastic tube um give me a second this thing i got this in the mail it came with a little plastic tube that i spat in and i shipped back to them so that was pretty cool um and they told me to wait about six to eight weeks before i got my results anyway that was about three to four weeks ago and today i got my results <laughs> Okay, so I'm on my Ancestry page. I haven't had a look at it yet, but I made a few estimations before all of this. So I'm going to go and get those. Okay, so I estimated that I was going to be about 40% Asian, about 50% British, and then about 10% other, other European. Now, for those of you that don't know or that haven't listened to the podcast at all, link in the description, um, I'm a, I'm a very proud Burmese man, you know, I was raised on, on a Kaswe and Mahinga, um, and I think that being Burmese is a big part of my heritage, um, so I really hope that I'm, you know, <laughs> at least mildly Burmese, <laughs> uh, on the same day my little brother made some estimations as well, and you'd think that our results would be a little bit similar, so he guessed that we're 32% Asian, 41% uh, British, and 13% other European. Um, but I guess all there's left to do now is actually dive in and have a look. <laughs> Fix my microphone. Alright, Henry, can you just hold that? Thanks. Alright, let's have a look. Discover your DNA story. <laughs> it's taking too long. <laughs> Got it. Alright. My DNA is up to date and I am pretty good actually. <laughs> so I'm 36% Western European. Germany, the Netherlands, Belgium and Luxembourg. Okay, so my grandmother was born in an area of the Netherlands known as Groningen. So that does make sense. So I am quite a bit Dutch, um, <laughs> which is cool to know. Um, and then about, what's that? 39% Asian, I guess 40, so that's that's pretty good. Uh, and South and East Asian, which makes sense because Burma is around here somewhere um, and it is in Southeast Asia. Where's Burma? There it is. Beautiful little Burma. Hey, there you go. Primarily located Myanmar, Burma. Beautiful. All right, that makes me, <laughs> that makes me feel good. <laughs> oh. Okay, so, so what else? Um, I'm only 9% British. That's crazy. Wow, okay. That's, so I thought I would be about 50% British. Um, that's crazy, I'm only 9% British. Primarily like I did English, Scotland and Wales. That's so funny. Um, both of my parents were born in England. Um, my mum's family is like deep Sheffield. Uh, my dad was first generation English. His parents were Burmese immigrants. So that's crazy that um, I'm only like 9% Great British. I thought that mum's side of the family would be much more British than that. Wow. View my DNA story over time. What does that even mean? Alright, let's click on this little information tab. That shows me nothing. Okay, now let's look at some of the low confidence regions. Now, these are all the areas that they're pretty confident um, are accurate, but then they have some that they're not too sure about. So Ireland, Scotland, and Wales, okay, uh, 4%, a little bit Polynesian, um, a little bit Melanesian, less than 1% Native American. That would be interesting. <laughs> a little bit Central Asian. I think all of these make sense, um, besides like Native American, I guess. Because I, I feel like, I don't know, I feel like Polynesian DNA would be pretty similar to sort of Southeast Asian, considering, you know, the whole Southeast Asian area, it stretches out to a lot of those islands, like um, the Philippines and things like that. I could imagine Polynesians being similar, I guess. 
So, uh, to sign off, my name's Anarchist Finch. I'm a proud 40% Southeast Asian man. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.